everyone welcome to my channel with a new video uh, today I have an iPad which has a blank screen and it was on charging for a few hours but it, it's not showing anything on the display but before I go deep in, into the solution I just want to say that Apple has determined that under certain circumstances the screen on a limited number of iPad Air third generation devices may go black permanently. A brief flicker or flash may appear before the screen goes black. Now, effective devices were manufactured between March 2019 to October 2019. So if you have an iPad third generation and you're having this problem, so you might want to contact Apple because, you know, they, they'll be able to solve your problem. You might get a new one from them or they, they'll be able to solve your problem you don't have to worry about it but if you have any other ipad air generation or older model or new model you're having this problem so there could be three things you know causing this problem now first of all i want to recommend that you, you got to make sure you always use the you know the MagSafe ipad charger oem original apple now some people i know they charge the ipad with the iphone chargers so that not only it damages the iPad battery, but it drains quickly as well and reduces its life. So the first solution we're gonna do is, you know, the simple one, the hard reset. So if your iPad has a home button, and what you're gonna do is you're gonna press and hold the power button and the home button at once, okay? So uh, just to let you know that this, uh, I have fixed the problem of this iPad and I will tell you what was actually wrong with it. So you press and hold the power button and home button. And as soon as you see the Apple device, I mean the Apple logo, you let it go. Okay. But before doing that, you got to make sure the iPad is on. So most of the times it, it solves lots of uh, glitches, you know, the software glitches and other issues. Now, this iPad was on charging, but as I said earlier, it was not. It was not actually charging. The reason was the charging port was not clean enough. I mean, there was something stuck in it, dust or you know the lint. So what I did is I used this toothbrush, you know, and uh, just cleaned it gently. Do not use anything metal, which you, which can uh, result damaging the charging port. And I just cleaned it gently and I used the compressed air. Okay, and I used the compressed air into the charging port. I hope you can see right here. And after that it started, I saw the, you know, the battery icon, that means it started charging. So, which is good. Now, if, if your problem is not solved by hard reset, the, the next thing you can do is you can um, connect your iPad with a charging cable, okay? And, uh, and you have to do the same thing, press the power button and home button together and keep it holding until you see the, your iPad in a recovery mode. Now, just to let you know, if you are using iPad without home button, to, to hard reset that, you have to press the volume up button quickly and release, and then press volume button, volume down button, and then you press and hold the power button. So, as you can see now, it says uh, connect to iTunes, and uh, it will solve your problem. You know, so you don't have to, you don't have to reset it, the whole iPad and then lose all the data. What you can do is, I'll show you later. Connect with my laptop that you can connect with your laptop and using 3U tool, just exit recovery mode, okay? So you don't have to update the software or restore the software, just exit recovery mode. So most of the time it solves the problem once you exit recovery mode. And uh, the next step I will be showing you how to connect it with 3U tool and through you tool and then uh, exit recovery mode and the third and last solution if not the, the the first two solution don't work then you're gonna have to connect it to again through your tools or itunes and then you're gonna have to restore it and 
you will end up losing all the data so now the next step let me just connect it with my laptop and i'll show you how to exit recovery mode and how that helps <laughs> Thank you.